Hey guys, welcome back and thanks for tuning in to Intricate. We're here with another interesting video. If you're looking for some information on Gorilla, the superstar, and want to know everything about her personal life and work, then you are at the right place and this video is just for you. Getting started with her early life. Gorilla, the emerging star was born Gloria Woods somewhere in the late 1990 or early 2000. So she must be around 22 years old now. She's from Memphis, Tennessee in the United States. There isn't much available regarding her family, and all we get to know is that she's the eighth out of her ten siblings. Talking about her studies, Gorilla attended two Fraser Community Schools, Westside Middle and Martin Luther King Jr. College Prep, and later moved before graduating from Melrose High. Get to know more about Gorilla as we follow her now on her amazing musical journey, also including some interesting facts about her. First of all, we'd like to tell you that her love of music came from the gospel. That is, before she got into the rap game, she began her musical journey singing in the local church choir in her hometown. Becoming part of this fast and furious new world, it just took one song for the Memphis rapper to go viral. Gorilla's spectacular climb began with a beat originally written for Megan Thee Stallion. When he didn't hear back from Megan quickly enough, Memphis producer Hit Kid contacted Gorilla, who was on her way to get her lashes done and said he wanted a summer song as soon as possible. He'd been following the artist since he saw her performing at a local showcase last year. She arrived at his studio straight from the appointment, went outside to smoke a blunt before entering the booth, and returned with the hook that changed the course of her life. Gorilla, eager to share, posted a portion of the hook to Thriller, a short video app that predated TikTok, which played over a video of her, blunt in hand, swaying from side to side before the song was even finished. It was very clever of her. The video quickly went viral in her hometown. A week and a half later, Hit Kid took her back to the studio to record a new verse for the song FNF and told her to return later that day with all her pals to film the video. It was uploaded the next day and began to spread across the internet. And now, FNF, also known as Let's Go, is charting on the Billboard Hot 100 at number 42 and reaching number one on the Billboard Mainstream R&B and Hip Hop Airplay chart. Undoubtedly becoming a top contender for Song of the Summer, got nominated for a BET Hip Hop Award as well. The viral song also sparked the hashtag FNF challenge on TikTok, and the music video generated over 40 million views on YouTube, catapulting Gorilla to national and global stages, including Rolling Loud Miami, Wireless Festival in UK, and Made in America 2022 in Philadelphia. So, you see, her decision to venture into the rap game paid off very well, as she's garnered support from significant stars in the industry. From Cardi B referring to FNF as the song of the summer, to Travis Scott and Def Lo proving themselves to be fans, Gorilla has caught the attention of other notable rappers. Her rise may appear to be an overnight success, but she is not just a TikTok rapper. Rather, the star has been grinding for a while now. And her hard work finally paid off in July, when she became the first female rapper to sign the Yo Gotti CMG label, a move that sparked a social media frenzy when Gorilla and her friends rolled up to Gotti's jet to sign the contract. She had recently announced Tomorrow 2, a new collaboration with Cardi B. The song is a follow-up to another fan-favorite track of hers, Tomorrow, released under the label CMG. Time for a fun fact here. Gorilla did not always intend to enter the rap game. However, she did know she wanted to use her voice in some ways. She did want to be a singer, but started smoking in her teens, which affected her voice. So, while smoking hampered her singing dreams, it all worked out in the end. She started churning out raps in 2019. Gorilla clearly has something special. Her deep voice, along with her Memphis accent, lends her a distinct sound in her rap numbers. And in an industry where women are sometimes pitted against one another, Gorilla isn't reluctant to share the spotlight with other female rappers, including her best friend, Gloss Up. Besides, Gorilla turned to rap as she also used to listen to and admire Chief Keef. As she began rapping, her cousin pushed her to take her rap career seriously, which eventually led to the release of the single Y'all Ain't S in 2020 and West Side Baby in 2021, where her smile and dance are contagious while the lyrics are a little harsh. When it comes to her moniker, Glorilla's legal name is Gloria, so one can see how her government and stage name play off of each other. However, the rapper initially went by Big Glow, though her cousin had a different notion. He actually came over Glorilla and she went for it. A quick look at her future plans. She wants to get into the acting world sooner than later, as she already has performed in a hood movie in Memphis and always hoped to appear in a big movie someday. Moreover, according to Billboard.com, 
She's also planning to release an FNF remix in collaboration with hit rapper Swati. You people may be curious, but Glorilla's present relationship status is unknown. The young rapper is believed to be single as she has not revealed anything about her love affairs. Get into her social media handles. Her popularity in the scene has helped her build a fan base of more than 1.5 million followers on her Instagram account, Glorilla Pimp. Even her current musical endeavors have been uploaded to her YouTube channel, the official Glorilla, with some 217k subscribers. Moreover, Glorilla is also there on TikTok with 447,000 followers, and 179,000 fans have followed her on Facebook. Let's now see Glorilla at community work. Glorilla recently surprised students and faculty at her alma mater, Martin Luther King Jr. College Prep High School, with a performance in a $25,000 donation to the school's senior and art program. She seemed overjoyed to be back in the hallway she formerly roamed and to greet familiar faces. Glow really attributed her discipline to high school on this occasion, an important skill that has aided her music career. Well, a shout out to Glow Rilla, and we'll definitely be keeping an eye on what she has to accomplish in the future. So let me ask you, what do you think of Glow Rilla? Do you like her music? Let us know in the comments down below. And if you enjoyed this video, do leave us a like. For more on the latest in pop culture, subscribe to our channel and turn on the notifications as well. Time to take your leave now. Take care, folks. Goodbye.